So in today's video, we're going to be introducing a new vehicle to the channel. This is my 1988 Nissan Desert Runner. This is something that I've been looking for for probably two or three years. And if you know anything about these, they're very difficult to find. Depending on um, where you look, only around 1,000 to 1,200 of these were produced. And it was a one year only vehicle. So Nissan actually in 1987 won the Baja 1000, the Mint 400, and the Gold Coast 300. And so to commemorate those victories, the following year they built this. And how you see it is exactly how it came from the factory. All of the graphics and the add-on pieces are all factory installed. So some of the special features that the Desert Runner included were front and rear two bumpers that were added on. And you can see it had fog lights both in the front as well as on top of the roll bar. All Desert Runners also came with a cooler holder in the bed as well as a spare tire carrier. And rather than a conventional tailgate, they all came with this net. So there were only three options that were available on the Desert Runner, and this truck has none of the three. Um, so the three options were you could get an automatic transmission, you could get a radio, and you could get air conditioning. So stepping inside, Obviously, we've got the manual transmission and there's just a blanking plate where the air conditioning button would have normally been. And then rather than having a, a radio, there's just a blanking plate down there and you can see there's no speakers in the door panels. And another thing to note in regard to the no AC is I believe that all of the non-AC trucks came with the sliding glass back window, whereas the air conditioning equipped trucks had just the solid glass window. And then on the dash here, you can see um, this switch with the amber and blue lights on it are your switches to control the fog lights. And then the only other real thing to note about the interior is that all Desert Runners came with bucket seats instead of a bench seat, which I believe is kind of unique for standard cab hard body trucks. And to go along with that, um, all Desert Runners only came in this configuration, the standard cab with the short bed. They didn't make any extended cab Desert Runners. So under the hood, there was only one option as well. No four cylinder was available on the Desert Runner. All you could get was the VG30i, which is a three liter V6 with throttle body fuel injection. And Nissan used this engine and these trucks from 86 to 89. They make about 138 horsepower and 167 pound feet of torque. And then a couple of items that were optional on regular 4x4 hard bodies but were standard on the Desert Runner are 31 inch BF Goodrich tires. And in the rear, you got a standard limited slip differential. So that's my 1988 Desert Runner. It's probably not a vehicle we're going to be doing a ton with on the channel, but it's such a unique vehicle and one that a lot of people have never seen or just didn't even know existed that I thought it'd be cool to put it out there. 
And if any of y'all have one of these and have any other information about them, definitely leave it down in the comments below. Other than that, thanks for watching and we'll see y'all in the next one.